Okay, this is probably a better format, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even mean to, oh God, lost my thing. All right, I just don't know. Um, so there's been a lot of things going on. A lot of people um, that I, I would address individually, but I can't. Um, but it's just a lot of things that have been, <sighs> it's a lot of stuff that's been going on behind the scenes. A lot of drama that just is like, can go prevent it, you feel me? Like, and you know, it's kind of been part of the reason why I have been uploading. Relationships with people break. Um, I've come to understand that. I've come to understand that not things don't last uh, forever, obviously, as well. Obviously, it's easier said, you know, easier spoken than actually thought out about. Because sometimes you think that relationships with a certain person would last, maybe even a lifetime, obviously not together. But then things break. Things happen. People distance themselves. And it's just like can't control it you know you can do all that you can do you can do everything right i guess you can say or at least the right thing to do because nobody's perfect everybody's gonna mess up you're human but at the end of the day uh that person can still pick their stuff up and just leave you know that person can still you know take certain steps to push themselves away from you i know that i used to do it and you know i used to be a uh not necessarily i was gonna say a victim I used to be a product of that, you know what I'm saying, that side effect where I just distanced myself. Um, so to those people who felt like they've been abandoned by me, who felt like I've closed the door on them, people who maybe have done me wrong in the past, but I may have just given up on the whole, you know what I'm saying, whether it's a friendship, whether it's a bond, whether it's a relationship, um, I just wanted to apologize to them as well. Um, there's a lot of things, you know what I'm saying, like that, that you guys don't know about. Um, part of it, yeah, part of my life obviously is being busy, obviously it's working um, and things like that. But at the end of the day, there are a lot of things like that I don't put effort into because I feel like they're going to fail. I feel like it's inevitable that things and relationships and people are going to fail, you know, me um, or others around me, you know what I'm saying? Like that's kind of how the motto has been for so long. So with that being said, um, I just wanted to use this time of the video because I know people who have broke people who I have broken relationships with. I know that they still watch my videos. They still keep up with me. I know that for a fact now, um, but I just wanted to, uh, uh, I just wanted to apologize. Um, I know even if it's not necessarily my fault that, you know, that we fell out or whatever the case, you know what I'm saying? Um, I just wanna apologize because at the end of the day, I'm supposed to be the bigger person. I'm supposed to, to know how to handle things. So if I let my emotions handle or dictate our relationship, like our bond, our trust, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I hope that I didn't make a decision in the heat of the moment to do so, you know what I'm saying? Um, rather than just actually, you know, wondering is this person actually, you know, figuring out is this person good or bad for me? Uh, things like that. So. You know, and sometimes people who I think that are bad for me at the time end up being good for me or end up work or work good for me. And I just didn't notice because I was just, like I said, in my in my emotions, in my feelings. Um, And so it's kind of tough. You know, I am not a person who usually lets emotions dictate things like that lately as of, you know, late 2020 or early 2021. It's been that way. Um, I'm going to say, say early 2020 as well. So the last maybe two years, things have been this way. And I don't know. I, don't, I mean, I know what's changed. And obviously, I'm not going to sit here and just confess everything and drop everything as what, what, you know, who's wrong with me or what's been done. Right. But I just know that I can't keep making excuses. I can't keep using these things and holding these things, you know what I'm saying, to like, like, bro, like, if somebody did me wrong, they did me wrong. I can't sit here and go into the next, whether it's friendship, whether it's, you know what I'm saying, even relationship, sitting here saying, well, oh, I can't do X, Y, and Z because this person did me wrong and I have trust issues and all this and that. Listen, at the end of the day, you can have trust issues. That's not a problem. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can have all these things. Uh... And insecurities included everybody's insecure you know what i'm saying um but at the end of the day i'm not gonna let this hover over me i'm not gonna let this be a shadow um and it just 
you know, I'm not going to let this cast over me. I'm not going to keep, you know, this burden, keep holding this burden, keep bearing with this burden of something else that someone else did wrong to me. You know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, they weren't meant for me. If they did, if they did me wrong, they weren't meant for me. If well, there's a friend that I put my neck out on the line for and they still did me wrong, they weren't meant for me. I can't keep holding on to what ifs and oh, maybe I could have done this better, this and that. Like I, I can't. So to the people who, like I said, there's people who genuinely hurt me and who still feel bad and keep up with my videos. There are people who maybe we had a heating fall, a heated falling out and still watch my keep up with whether it's people, my friends, whether it's, you know what I'm saying? Um, so at the end of the day, I, to those people who truly deserve this, I apologize. I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? Anything that, you know, you felt that I've wronged you for, um, you know, I, it's my fault. I'll take, I'll take ownership or I'll take, you know, fault for the things that I've done and things like that. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm never going to be, I'm not going to sit here and hold these people to something that a past person did to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not fair to them. And I, and, and as far as like, I don't know about relationships or whatever. Um, but as far as going into the future, um, whether it's friendships, relationships, whatever, um, I can't sit here and, and, and think it's going to fail. I can't sit here and bet on it that it's going to fail because mentally that's what sometimes what happens when you don't, you know, when things don't go your way ever, you think that you tend to be like get into this relationship and be like, oh, well, it's not going to work anyway. Or in the back of my mind, oh, yeah, well, she's going to do something. She's going to do me dirty. You can't think like that. I can't think like that. I have to do better. And that's what I, I strive to be. I strive to be better. I can't let the negativity and the, you know, the, the mental burden and the strain that I've carried over from everybody else affect future endeavors and relationships. So I just want to say that I apologize dearly for the people who deserve it, for the people who obviously did me wrong and still continue to not change their ways um, and still try to reconnect with me, all this and that. Like, I'm good. You stay over there. You're not for me. If you want to watch my videos and support me, I appreciate that. Um, but I'll never, you know what I'm saying, forget what y'all have done. Um, I can forgive you, but I, again, I can't forget. Um, but I just wanted to put this out here because there are some some things that had needed to be said. And I can't even put, it's sad that I can't put context on these things, right? But part of some of these things affect me mentally. And it just kills my motivation for uploading for YouTube. Um, obviously, like I said, working you know doing my thing is obviously it takes a lot of time and obviously i can make time for other things but at the end of the day it will literally drain me of all the energy good energy that i have to sit here and think about what you know what I'm saying what happened or what went on and things like that and i was just recording a video and i just caught myself really rant doing a two minute rant about it you know what i'm saying like i feel like i should do better i feel like i need to do better and and i will you know what I'm saying? So again, to the people that deserve it, seriously, I apologize. And not trying to sit here and, and pity apologize or anything like that. Like I've reflected. I know I know what things I've done wrong or said. Um, some people I can't even get in contact with. I don't know. They must be that mad that of the falling out, you know. Um, but I, I, that's all I can do. So uh, it's been your boy Rich. Uh, I know my upload schedule. <laughs> pretty bad, but um, hang in there. Okay, I'm coming. All right, reach out.